Hey everybody. In this video, we're doing the simplest chi-squared goodness of fit test, asking whether sample data is being drawn from a particular given distribution. This example that we're going to do is completely typical. Um, so we're looking at families of size 3 and wondering if the distribution of the number of girls in those families is really binomial um, with n equals 3 and p equals 0.5 as we'd expect if the genders of children were actually 50% women and 50% men. Um, so in a random sample of size 100, we get this certain distribution, and we'd like to test at significance level alpha equals 0.05 the hypothesis that the distribution of girls in these families really is b of 3 comma 0.5. So that's equivalent to the notion that 12.5% of the families will have no girls, 37.5% will have one girl, and so on. These are just binomial probabilities. So translating that into numbers in the sample, multiplying by 100, we expect um, that 12.5 of the families will have no girls, 37.5 of the families will have one girls, girl, etc. Um, we don't worry about the fact that these aren't integers. These are expected frequencies, um, not actual numbers of not actual numbers of families. Okay, so now we can do the chi-squared test in the same way as before. We're going to take each of those categories and we're going to take the difference between um, what we got and what we expected, square it, and divide by the expected value, add all those up. And that's going to be our chi-squared statistic. It's going to quantify how um, unusual or commonplace our sample is in the context of all possible samples from that distribution of the null hypothesis. We get 6.97. We're looking in the distribution chi-squared of 3, 3 degrees of freedom, because there are four categories here. And the probability of getting a chi-squared value at least that extreme is 0.073. So not huge, but also not small enough to reject the null hypothesis in this case. The data does not provide sufficient evidence to conclude that the distribution of girls in three-child families is not binomial. 